So what is dubstep? Now I see I see people in the comments of YouTube constantly trying to debate over this, but it's actually really simple. I've also seen a few videos on YouTube trying to explain this, but one they're either completely ignorant, two a joke, or three a little hard to follow. So I thought I'd make my own. Well, the concept is actually really, really simple, but I completely understand why a lot of people don't understand what dubstep is. Because unlike rock and roll, blues, and country, dubstep isn't really defined by how it sounds, but more based on the track's structure. Defining a track as dubstep, there are three bare minimum characteristics that it needs to have. One is the tempo. A tempo is the speed of the track, and a dubstep track usually ranges from anywhere from 135 to 150 beats per minute, but typically, in most cases, it, it's uh, in the 140 range. Now, a drum pattern is also a big characteristic of dubstep. It's going to have halftime drums, which means there is a kick on every first beat and a snare on every third. And you can also add some variations in. Now, the third characteristic is a prominent sub bass. Okay? Now, if you, for those of you who don't know what a sub bass is, it's typically a bass line that is rather felt than heard. So it's a very low frequency, which means it's typically below 100 hertz.